back here at my favorite place, the Birmingham Zoo, and we are going to introduce you to sisters today. Kelly, not one of the sisters, is talking to us about the Gulf Coast sheep. And Kelly, I, you just don't think of beach and sheep together, right? Tell us about these two. Oh, you generally don't. Um, these are Rosie and Grace, our two Gulf Hi. Coast sheep. Um, they are about two years old. And are they twins? Um, yeah, they're about twins. They have Aww. the same birthday. And as you can see, they've been recently shorn. We tend to shear them about twice a year, once in April and once in August, just to make sure they stay nice and cool for the summer. I was about to ask you, how do you know when they need to be shorn? Am I using the, the, the tents correctly? How, how do you oh, all yeah. decide when that should happen? Well, generally we just try to keep a an eye on the length of their wool, and if it looks like it's getting too big, we'll go ahead and shear them. Now, tell us about Gulf Coast sheep. What is their natural habitat? Is it actually the beach? Or are they just in South Alabama? Or? Oh, they, their ancestors came from Spain in the 1500s and were raised all along the southeastern states. And they actually do pretty well here. They have a natural resistance to the heat and humidity, and they also have a good resistance to parasites, too. So they do well down here. Really, to heat and humidity. And you would think with wool on them that they would be so hot in, in the summertime, but that's not always the case, right? Oh, not always. Their faces are usually pretty bold and stomach too, so, and their legs, so it keeps them pretty, pretty cool. cool off. Yeah. Now, what their personalities like? Are they talkative to they very much? Or are they just peaceful little animals? Oh, they can be pretty loud when they want food. <laughs> when they're hungry? Oh, yeah. Now, last time we came by here, they were eating leaves off a branch. What's their favorite food? If, if, if they could request their meals, what would they like? Oh, I'd say leaves are their favorite. So that, I mean, they were ripping them right off of a branch when we came in here. Oh, yeah, they love it. All right, so Gracie, Grace and Rosie. Oh, now, this one is, that they have, do they know their names? Oh, they know their names, they yeah. They just came walking up. They're so sweet. Um, here in the barn, you have sheep, you have goats. They all get along pretty well, don't they? Oh, uh, they do. Some are more friends than others, but they tend to get along. Get out of the way so y'all can get video. There you go. They're naturally curious. Do they like to interact with guests? And, and what, do, what kind of questions do guests ask you about these two most often? Uh, usually they ask if they've been shorn, um, their age, their names. Oh, how old are they? Oh, they're two years old. Oh, they're just children. Well, they are so pretty. Um, I would like to have them in my backyard. If you ever decide to rehome them, just keep <laughs> me on the list, okay, Kelly? Oh, sure. Well, there you go. Bye, ladies. Your haircut looks lovely, and it holds up well in the humidity. How about that? We'll be right back here on the CBS 42 Morning News.